Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. It's me, Rachel, if you guys are new to my channel. Today I have a really cool Target Dollar Spot video to share with you guys. But really quick, before I show you guys my mini haul, if you guys can hit that like button and that subscribe button. That way you guys don't miss out on any future videos that I post. Um, there actually will be a part two of this video because literally as soon as I got there, Target was putting out more and more stuff as I was leaving and I just couldn't wait there all day for them to finish so I probably will go back and post another video later this week so just FYI you guys don't want to miss out on that so they are putting out all their Easter decor as well for 2019 so I'm super excited and let me show you guys really quick a little mini haul of what I got and then we will go ahead and I'll do a shop with me so you guys can see the rest of the stuff that I did find when I was there okay so really quick I want to show you guys I got this really cute little egg holder it was only one dollar and it is beautiful little it looks like crystal but it's super pretty I thought this would look really cute in my coffee bar okay the next item I got were these eggs um, these are like a I don't know like a pretty um, Robin's blue maybe color and they were only three dollars and if you guys are into wooden eggs they actually had some wooden eggs there they look like wood and they are come in the same four pack for three dollars so I don't know I just didn't know if it'd be my thing so I left it behind and now I'm kind of regretting that because it would go super cute with this sign here so it just says hello spring and it just has some jute string some twine to hang it up with and I just thought this was really pretty really rustic and pretty looking okay, and then here is the last item I picked up guys I tried to be really good I'm trying to be very precise with the things that I do buy because I either end up having to go back and take it or return it or I really don't use it so I don't want to I'm trying this whole new minimalism kind of slash decluttering lifestyle so I'm not trying to collect so much stuff but this is the last thing that I got um, this one was three dollars as well and it just says happy Easter and it kind of has that like shiplap I don't know what you call this type look but with the white trim I thought it was really pretty and it matches the eggs and so I just thought that was really pretty. So let's go ahead and get on with the rest of the video. So they brought back the cute little Easter trees. Um, these are $5 each. And then they also have a couple of different kinds of the towel sets for $3 each. And here are the cute little egg holders and they had a couple of different colors as well. And then they also had some more of the like little tree types, but the, these are floral, they're also $5. And then here's a couple of different wooden signs. This one said carrot patch, this one says happy Easter. And then this cute little bunny tail, I love this one. And then you have a blank canvas as well. So you have a nice selection of carrots if you guys want variety and then here are the eggs i was talking about they've got like a purple pastel color and then if you look closely there's the wooden ones as well so these glass carafes were three dollars each and then they have the gorgeous um, cake plates and they look like crystal but of course they're glass and they have the pretty rose colored as well So they had these little twine holders, um, I guess for your garden area in a couple of different colors. So that was unique, different. I've never seen these before. Um, and then they had uh, these uh, watering cans. So I really like this one, the white one, but I know um, some of you guys will probably like this black rustic looking one. Um, that one was really nice. And then they had a yellow one and a green one as well. Me 
So they had a couple of these Easter little standalone signs, which were cute. And then they also had these really cute wooden ornaments. Um, I'm assuming to put on like a little Easter tree. These were really adorable. And then they also had um, some little characters as well. Okay, and they had some really cute pillows. They had this cute carrot one, and then on the back it had a different pattern. And then they had this pretty blue one, and I really like the little trim on the edges. And then they had this cute hip hop bunny one uh, with the little pom pom tail. I really like that one. That one was just plain pink on the back, and then this one was plain blue on the back. And then they had these cute little wheelbarrow planters or decorations, whatever you want to do with them or call it. But I thought they were super cute for $5 each. And they also had a white one too. And then they had these really cute glass uh, coffee mugs for $3 each, which I thought was a really good deal. I really like this bright yellow one. And they had Easter grass for $1. They had a bunch of different colors. Then they had these little eggs that I think have a hidden toy inside. Um, those are super cute to hide for Easter maybe. Then they had Easter chalk um, and this one was cool because it has like it comes with its own handle. And then they they did have these previously but I don't remember seeing these two specific ones. Um, they're just for the kids to do like creative play with. And I don't know about if I would buy dirt so that's up to you guys but they also have the Easter egg chalk, and it's only $1, so that was a good deal. I think they sell the same at the Dollar Tree. And then they had, I could not find the price for these, but it's like a projection on the ceiling. I imagine it's like 5 maybe $7, but um, this was something new that I hadn't seen before. And then they had a couple of other items that went with it. So they had cute little Easter egg or plates for $1 and then the spoons to match. And then they also had these cute little cups as well that I thought were adorable. These were $3 each. And that's it for this video. Don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss out on part two and I will catch you guys in the next one.